back to my channel. And if you're new here, welcome to the Vibe Tribe family. Today we have a unboxing and first impressions from Crafties. They reached out to me and asked me if I would be interested in sharing them on my channel. And I was like, um, yeah, <laughs> let's do this. So for today's video, there you are going to hear howling cats in the background because we have renovations going on and we have to keep the cats locked up so you're going to hear some banging you're going to hear some vacuuming you're going to hear the cats howling but we get through the video and is it worth it do i like crafties or don't i guess you gotta watch to find out but first let's pay a little homage and respect to the patreons and youtube community members everyone how's it going how's your day so far hopefully it's a fantabulous one sherry here aka purple door crafts and as you could see by the title we have an unboxing and first impressions from crafties crafties had reached out to me and asked me if i would do an unboxing for them on my channel and give my thoughts I was like, um, let me think here. Yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> I have seen numerous videos from them. They have legally licensed artwork, which is huge to me, as you guys know. So here we stand. Now, I do want to make this clear. This is not a review. This is my first impressions. And if I seem a little woo, squirrely, squirrely, extra, we have lots going on right now. I am a busy, busy little squirrel running around roaming. It's spring <laughs> between my reselling business, which is going crazy. We have renovations going on in the home, which you are definitely probably going to hear in the background. Hey, okay. hashtag life happens. And I have fired up a new venture, Sensi, which you guys are going to hear more about this weekend. We, you guys, are going to get some videos this weekend. Normally, I don't upload on the weekend, but I need to make up and I need to be able to sit down and diamond paint. Seriously, you guys, I have not even diamond painted for hashtag let's get your big and DB event. I can't even say the hashtag. Give me one second, you guys. So you may get a lot of that throughout the video which is fine. That's what happens when you got home renovations going on. We're getting new floors and they look amazing. I can't wait to show you guys. Okay, so like I said, I got lots going on. We're gonna talk more about that in a whip and chat. Let's bust into this package. So I was pretty excited to see when Crafties had reached out to me. They also asked me to join their affiliate program. Um, I'm waiting to hear back from the lady. I had reached out to her and told her I received my package and, you know, she was going to give me a code for you guys to use. Uh, it'd be for 20% off, but I haven't heard back from her. She asked me how the painting was and how everything looked. And I emailed her back saying, I don't know. I haven't seen it. Um, I like to film my unboxings and first impressions, you know, like this. You guys get to see me literally bust open the package. That way you're getting a genuine first impressions 
and not something, I don't know, I don't know how else to describe it. You know what I mean. I want a genuine first impressions. Oh, I am excited for this kit. I have seen this artist on other websites and I couldn't, I can't afford it. I believe it's DIY Moon Shop. Oh, so this is Sybil Art. Oh, I'm excited. So the box did come a little, a little bent. That's okay. So oh, let's just break this open, you guys. I'm like so squirreling. I'm just excited. I've seen quite a few creators in the community unbox crafties, and it does look like really nice quality painting. Let me get you guys down a little better there. So it does have some bubble wrap around it. It is poured glue, which you guys know is definitely my preference. So the painting came absolutely fine. Absolutely fine. It's in a diamond painting condom, as I call it. I've actually, I haven't called it that in a long time. Another creator started calling it that, so I stopped. <laughs> but they don't create no more, so. Okay. So you probably already had a peek there. So I'm going to insert a photo on the screen of what this image is. You guys know I love Alice in Wonderland. Don't mind my nails. I need to go get them filled. As I've been packaging boxes and stuff, I've been breaking them. But I love Alice in Wonderland. Squirrel. <laughs> and when I seen this kit on their site, it was like no brainer. This is the one that we're getting. So the canvas material is not like a hard canvas material. It flattened out very nice. Let's get you guys. I'm waiting for my new tripod to get here. Don't mind, you're gonna hear the cats in the background. We have to keep them locked up because of the renos going on. Oh, you guys, she is so pretty, so pretty. All right, so let's take a look at the toolkit. Here are the diamonds. The, I did get this in a round. I actually ordered from this website using Diamond Painting with Donnie's. Uh, she had a coupon code, so I used her coupon code, and I ordered a custom. I want to see how their customs look. So for this canvas here, you get two light blue squishies. You get two rectangular chunks of wax, which is the more transparent wax. The thicker wax is, from what I gather, from what other creators say is better wax. I don't use the wax that comes with the kits, but this would still do the job. You get two pens, one with a three-placer, one with a six-placer. You get a metal pair of tweezers and a white boat. This is a perfect toolkit. I would call this not a generic toolkit, but a level up from a generic toolkit because you get two of everything. You'd have more than enough wax. So that is definitely nice. The other thing is they have, their boxes are branded. That is nice to see when a company gets branded boxes. Their pricing is excellent. As you've seen, when I posted the photo, I put the price of this painting up. So how is Craft Ease different? We actively promote independent artists and collaborate with them by remunerating them for their hard work and inspiring art. So I'm, I'm thrilled, like, oh, you guys, Okay, hum, grooves for Ba. Bring it down a couple notches, Murphy. <laughs> it 
which is I have wanted one of Sybil Arts canvases for a long time and I can't afford DIY merch shop. So let's take a look at, so this is a 40 by 50. We will do the measuring right away. You get a thumbnail up in the corner here. It does have AB diamonds. Woo, yay. And oh, 666 AB. Oh, that's gonna look pretty, you guys. So you have only the one schematic there. You don't have one down here, which is fine. It's not that big of a canvas. So it's not that big of a deal. I'm gonna bring this up in, as you guys can see. The symbols are not, there are no dummy circles or dummy lines around the symbols, which is nice to see. So it looks like for the AB, there are three. We got the 310, which is L. So her bow is going to be in ABs. And then for the other AB is her lips and this little red heart. So anywhere you see black is an AB. Anywhere you see the red is an AB. And S. 963. So which one is that one? Let's look for S, you guys. Where's S? I wonder if you guys will see spot it before I do because I have tired eyes. Oh, come on now, Murphy. You can find S. Seriously? I can't find S, you guys. <laughs> oh, it's in the bunny's ears right there. So that... That is a nice spread of AB diamonds. So far, I am, I'm liking, I am really liking. So, port, it's got some stick to it. That's why when, like, when they reached out to me and asked me if I would, you know, do this on my channel, I was like, um, yeah, yeah, like now, hi, over here. <laughs> because I have seen their paintings. So this is going to be a gorgeous canvas. I can't wait to get my custom. I, I ordered a custom from them. So I am going to upload this video, whether I have heard from the brand or not, because I wanna get my video up. And if I haven't, if the coupon code for you guys is not, I haven't heard from her by the time I'm done filming, then I will put it in the comments and I will pin it. But there is a coupon code you guys are going to be able to use. Yes, I am going to make a commission off of it, which helps me put back into the channel. You know, I had thought about it. You know, I spoke with Mr. Purple in regards to doing becoming an affiliate again and you know I spoke with some friends why not I like the products but you guys I am not just an affiliate for crafties I am an affiliate for another brand as well which you guys will find out this weekend in the whip and chat so that's exciting as well so I'm not sure if it's official that I am an affiliate with Crafties or if it's just a coupon code. I haven't heard from her. I'm just waiting to hear back, but I'm pretty sure. So there will be something. It'll just be either in the description, in the comments. Anywho, squirrel. I'm just rambling. Beep, 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 beep. <laughs> Let's take a look at these diamonds. Okay. So on the bag here, okay, interesting, interesting. So on the bag, they do not have the DMC numbers. They have like, uh, as you see in your schematic here, one through 24, that's how the bags are labeled one through 
So as you can see, they all say DP1041. But before we look at the diamonds, we're going to measure to see if it's true to size. Ah, I almost forgot. I bet you guys were going up. Oh, she hasn't measured yet. She's totally squirreling and rambling and going on. And she's going to forget to measure. Ha ha. I caught myself. So I'm going to put it so you guys can see. I am on the line. And it is 39 and a half. I am not going to dock them points for half a centimeter. So 39 and a half that way. Let's see if it is 50 this way. I know, Pam Pan. I hate having my cats locked up like that. They have food, water, litter boxes, but it is for their own safety. Okay, and going this way, I got to stretch the canvas. We are on the line, so we are just under 49. So we are at 48 and a half centimeters. So it is a little, it's a little off sizing, about a centimeter and a half. Give me one second, folks. Mr. Purple is hollering. And we're back. We have packages. There were packages at the door for me. Yay! But I love packages. So it is, the sizing is a little off, but you know, I'm gonna say, like, you can see that there is some folding there. So it's probably, let me do that one more time this way, just to make sure. Because if it if it's more than a centimeter off, I'm gonna say that it is. Okay, yeah, see, if you guys can see, I was off on my measuring the first time. It is actually almost at 50 centimeters. You can pause, you can look. There we go. I was off on my measuring, so I do apologize for that. It is true to size. So let's take a peek at our diamonds. I'm going to put her upside down so I can kind of see the shade number so you guys can see. Normally, I don't call them out. Oh, you guys, look. <gasps> look at that black. That is going to look gorgeous in her bow and her gloves. And Oh, it's going to take everything I have not to work on this painting. Okay, next, <laughs> we have 402, and then here is our red 666, which is my son's birthday, which is actually coming up. Carson was born on the sixth day of the sixth month of the sixth year at 3.33 in the morning and 33 seconds. Lots of strange, right? Next, we have 647. Not very many 647, so... The diamonds are looking very nice. Five is okay. I've got a. I'm actually gonna put it. Oh, now I'm gonna. I'm gonna go this way. There we go. That's better. Five is six. I need glasses. Six four eight. I definitely much prefer when they have the DMC code on the bag, but it's. I mean, I'm definitely not gonna get pissy over that. So we got 781. The diamonds are looking really nice. I'm not seeing any concaving. They look nicely shaped. Next, we have 782. Okay, sounds good, love. And then we have 783. Next, number nine. Which we have two ba two bags of nine, which is eight oh three. Eight fourteen. Eight twenty three. So that is our first strip of diamonds. I seriously need to go get my eyes checked, you guys, because I am not, I am struggling to see these numbers. Next, 
Now Suri's acting up. Things are just going all wickety wonkety here. Huh. I do apologize again, you guys, about the noise, but it is to have these beautiful floors, it is worth the noise. Next, we have 927. And 13 is 931. Nine forty-five. I can flip it over there. You guys can get a better view of the diamonds. Now fifteen. We have nine fifty-one. This is actually one recommendation that I would make to crafties: is maybe make the schematic numbers a little bit bigger. Like they are really small. I will show you guys momentarily. So nine thirty-one. And then we got 945. And then we have another AB. We got two. 17, so 963. So there are a lot more S's than just the rabbit ears. I must have missed a lot of S's. I'm gonna have to, we're gonna have to take another peek at this canvas, you guys. 18 is 3371, which is that chocolate brown color. 19 is 37.56. And then we've got quite a few bags of 20. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six bags of 37.76. So that is the background, like all the letter A's. This whole background is going to be this color. Again, I will throw a photo on the screen of the image so you will see, because I thought it was going to be white, so interesting. Next, yeah, they definitely need to enlarge their numbers. 21 is 3827. And then we got two bags of 3842. We got 33 3856 with a blue straggler in there. Yeah, these diamonds look really nice, you guys. And then 3865. between the Renos, the Howling Cat. So I am impressed with the diamonds. Excellent. I'm excited. I am really excited for this canvas, you guys. I'm even more excited to see what the... Uh, Give me one second, you guys. Oh, okay, you guys. I just wanted to make sure she was okay because she was just howling there. So I'm looking for S's. We're looking for S's because you can see the bunny ears there and you got two bags of that color. I'm reading things right here, right? I'm reading things right. Or do I got total tired eyes here. Yeah, they gave us two bags of S's of that beautiful shade. You know what, let's not worry about it. And cause I can see that like, like throughout the A's there's different, there's like P. So definitely when you're, when I'm working on this, like you've got R. So this, that's her uh, apron. So this is definitely gonna be something that is gonna have to be on my to-do list very soon. It is not overly confetti heavy. She's going to be absolutely gorgeous, you guys. I'm excited. So without dragging this out any longer, for my first impressions, my one recommendation that for me would definitely be maybe enlarging the schematic. As you can see, it's not very big. The numbers are very small. And it, you know, 
that that would be like my number one recommendation is just maybe enlarging the schematic a bit maybe putting one down here just because that one is so small but it's not something that would make me go <laughs> not interested no i absolutely recommend going over and checking out crafties they have three or four different artists they also have paint by numbers they have accessories so you guys, as you can hear between the cat and the renovations, it's an interesting unboxing, but this is life. I'm not here to try to be perfect, fake, none of that. This is me, no bullshit. So on that note, I am gonna bid the all farewell and I shall see you guys in this weekend's Whip and Chat. Patreons and YouTube members, you are finally going to get some videos and uphold my commitments stay positive live blessed and until the next time many many blessings namaste bye guys mm -hmm.